so guys here i'm making a video with my speakers guys my speaker collections here um we're gonna start over here guys with my spectrum these are my studio spectrum 18 for speakers guys you can see on the side very thick heavy heavy speaker guys very nice piece guys let's see what's going on down here let me guys show it to you guys very nice speakers guys um i bought this from the owner uh, he moved out he sold his house and moved to a smaller house uh, he was gonna probably retired and he don't want to deal with this anymore because it's it is heavy guys this speaker guys is heavy 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 speakers and i don't think he can handle this so he sold it to me and i'm really happy and the sound quality of the speakers guys is amazing um, four-way speakers guys replace the tweeter with the pioneer tweeters and it sounds much much better way better than before very very nice speakers guys so there's no way that i would sell this um no way in in, in many years very nice and it's hard uh, to find this kind of speakers and speakers guys like i do have moran sansui and they are expensive they are 300 500 dollars especially the vintage ones so um the speakers it's it's when i bought it it's a good deal it's cheap when i bought it the price was so very low so he just don't want to deal with it anymore and i took it over so now it's in my collections guys so these are my studio spectrum speakers guys and over here down here guys over here we we have this um poke um two poke subwoofers they are very nice um i don't know if i can crack this open i'm not quite sure yes you can so let's open it guys so you guys can see all right yeah so let's move this vintage clock right here this little clock there it is guys nice piece the the sound the, the sub amazing subwoofer sound guys two of them very nice piece guys and i got it for a very low price so and it's in my collections yeah so those are poke guys and they are expensive but i got it for a very low price a lot of people don't want to deal with this kind of stuff anymore they want to deal with music or they move out or they move to another state so they don't really care anymore and over here guys i have two venturis very nice speaker guys I'll show you guys right here it's a cool piece it's wooden made very nice uh, wooden made speakers guys so let's crack that open guys so you guys can see yeah there it is guys look at that guys amazing amazing piece it's, it's meant to look in it's a good condition speakers and the sound quality guys amazing these are hard to find nowadays you can get it on ebay but not just you know out there on the street and you'll see on a, on a garage sale or something you might but they're not gonna sell it very cheap like you know the way um how i pay it so it's a very very good speakers guys very nice sound yeah and over here guys i have this jvc so i got some of these vinyl records let's pull this out put it inside for now so this is my jvc guys and i want to show you guys this jvc that i bought for a very very good price and it's still in a good condition guys look at that guys it's a SKS22 guys JVC made in Japan very nice sound guys I tested it out and it's a very very good sound yeah so another another vintage speakers guys amazing yeah and you got the tweeters here mid-range and the tweeter 
yeah and that's the model the brand specifications yeah and over here I got this vintage clock it's a very nice world time clock nice very nice piece and I pay five dollars for that very very cool and right here guys let's move over here I want to show you guys my one and only Morantz all right these are very very nice speakers guys vintage and it's hard to find nowadays look at that guys very mint no cracks in whatsoever very cool very clean and sound quality guys amazing it's another thick speakers guys from Morantz very very nice piece guys Look at that guys spectrum and morantz and another one down here Look at that. very very nice guys and over here guys i have my bose mp3 uh bluetooth you know um player very nice piece and I have my Harman Kardon here, Bluetooth, yeah. And over here, guys, I have my Technics speakers, vintage. Very nice, guys. I want you guys to see this. Look at that, guys. Very, very nice piece, guys. Amazing, amazing speakers. These are the SB-X10 Techniques by Panasonic very nice sound the quality sound guys amazing um very very clean looking and look at this guys very rare that you can see like that yeah and over here guys i have my klh these are broken and i fixed it i patched it because there's some cracks but it still works and I pay very good price for this. So hard to find guys. Look at that. Very cool piece. Yeah. So another um, speakers that I bought that and this thing is heavy guys. It's small speakers, but it's heavy. Very, very nice. Usually guys, these are heavy speakers. They are they are not light, like cheap speakers. Especially that one right there. Very heavy guys. Very, very heavy. This one here. Yeah. And so was the Morantz heavy speakers vintage very very nice speakers guys even the small ones still heavy uh, smaller ones still heavy yeah and I do have Sansui speakers um, I did not st stock in over here to make a video but next time I'll do that I'll make another video with my Sansui and uh, I'll show it to you guys so this is my speakers uh, collections guys and I still have a small Marantz somewhere up there but uh, there's no more room over here so I don't want to clatter and stuck them double stock them and it's gonna you know so yeah so these are my speakers collections guys and uh, it's another video from all of my collections with my speakers and my stereos up there as you can see Marantz uh, Techniques Pioneer JVC Lafayette um, Sansui and my vinyl records and even here I got tape deck right here from uh, this is from uh, Fisher made in Japan very nice piece guys and over here I have my Luxman very very nice piece guys i pay 750 us dollars for this and fisher very nice and luxman tuner so there it is guys you see seen um, my collections and some of my collections here and these are our video from my speakers guys to share it to you guys so thanks for watching guys and i'll see you next time for now i'll say bye -bye. i uh, put all the speakers here so you can see I stack them up my Moran's speaker yeah um, 
I have my Polk to Polk uh, subwoofer. And this is my Venturi speakers, two of them. And some of the vinyl records that doesn't fit, can't fit there anymore. So what I did is I just, you know, I just stuck them in there. Yeah. And we have the JVC up there. Yeah. So I got another one. There's two JVC um, speakers. And over here, guys, my favorite speakers here, guys, is my, uh, this is my, studio spectrum you know so i bought this uh, as you can see here in the side it's really thick and heavy and i bought this from the guy that moves out and sold his house and doesn't want to deal with it anymore so yeah so now it's here and uh very nice speakers guys as you can see you know yeah and I'm looking here if there's cracks or anything so I can fix it. Yeah, it seems like it, yeah, it seems like there's none, so it's good. And uh, he replaced the Pioneer on the tweeter with the Pioneer tweeter, so it got better. Um, this is our this is uh, four-way speakers, guys. So there's two, then there's one on the bottom and here on top. Yeah, so. And I got some Harman Kardon and Sony. And yeah, guys, so this is the 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 stereo room, which is my collections, my vintage room. And now it's finished. Um, but when I come up with something again, and then maybe I'll, I don't know, maybe I'll take some of that stereo south and open this area here but uh for now i guess that's it so yeah so guys that's it for today and uh, another video from my music room and uh thanks for watching and i will see you in the next video so i say bye bye